The dish ran away with his spoon. The little dog laughed to see such a fact that the dish ran away with his spoon. It seems as if those rhymes that we learned in school has messed our brain up. Because I do believe that in this country, you still have people that would believe that the cow can jump over a moon. People will probably still believe that there's a cow that can jump over a moon. Some things that people tend to believe make me shake my head and rocks me to the core. Especially Americans. There are some people, including the president, when they believe what they believe, nothing can change their mind. Even if Jesus Christ was to come down and say to them otherwise, then they still wouldn't believe it. Trump is still preaching that he won the election, even though there are lots of evidence to say he did not. And so are about 50% of his followers. They're still saying that he won. And there's no data to back that up. What do people need to do to believe in what is before their eyes? Are people just fools? Or there's some sort of other things going on. These days, things that people believe, I wonder, man. Intelligent people, lawyers, doctors, people with master's degree, with doctorate degrees, and some stuff that they, they come out of their mouth and some stuff that they believe in, OMG. It rocks me to the core and we, I just have to wonder what intelligence is. Were people duped at school with these nursery rhymes? Back in school we learned ring a ring a rose, your pocket full of posy. A whoosha, a whoosha, the horse fall down. <laughs> hickory, hickory duck, the mouth run up the clock. The clock strike one and down the mouse run. All these nursery rhymes did do too well for us because like I said some of the things that people really believe in eh, I'm amazed <laughs> even the president who is supposed to be the, the greatest leader on earth the greatest leader he so he's supposed to be the greatest leader and even him cannot think straight and even him will believe anything and he'll believe some stuff out of this world that you have to wonder you know, if he has the same brain as some other people, or is he crazy? Here we are, even in the midst of a pandemic, and you do have people will tell you that the coronavirus is a myth, and it's a hoax. People who are infected too, on dying beds, that will say it's a hoax. Take a listen. Said that even now, the, the, the hospital is being overrun with COVID patients. They come in, they're horribly ill, they're gasping for breath, and yet they don't believe they have COVID? Yeah, I think the hardest thing to watch is that people are still looking for something else and they want a magic answer and they don't want to believe that COVID is real. And the reason I tweeted what I did is it wasn't one particular patient, it's just a culmination of so many people and their last dying words are, um, this can't be happening, it's not real. And when they should be spending time FaceTiming their families, they're filled with anger and hatred. And it just made me really sad the other night. Is it that people doesn't think for themselves? President Trump will say anything. And there are some media stations that they twist the truth 360 degrees and there are people who still loves to watch them and say yeah it's true even when the truth is before their eyes what's happening to this world man too many nursery rhymes are too much folk tales or people are just ignorant and stupid 
What do you think? Is it the food? Maybe it's the food. Maybe it's the drink. Maybe it's the water. Let me know what you think by commenting down below. Can you like, share, and subscribe? Thank you for watching. Like the video before you go. Please subscribe if you haven't done so. And remember to share the video with your friends and family. And browse the channel for more quality content. Until next time, walk good, my friends.